Hi, this is Marla with MarlaGetsFit.com and today is day number 277 of my low carb, high fat lifestyle change. And yesterday was my birthday and I mentioned on my video yesterday that um, it was the Christmas party for my husband's work it was tomorrow or yesterday night. And so I decided to make that a little combination Christmas party, uh, birthday party type of thing. And I decided to do splurge and go ahead and eat um, what was on the menu and that sort of thing. So I wanted to, um, I took a couple pictures so you could take a look at that. So as you can see, we had a lot of fun. It was at um, this really cool old estate that was built in like 1895, something like that. Um, it's in Jacksonville, Oregon. It's called the Noonan Estate, and I think now it's converted to some sort of a bed and breakfast. I know you can rent rooms, um, and there's a bunch of rooms and different outbuildings and in the big, huge mansion. And they have a little restaurant there um, called the Onyx, I think is what it was. Anyway, they rented the whole restaurant out and had a really great meal. We had ribeye steak, really, really good. It was so tender and some mashed potatoes and some green beans. So it really was not that bad as carb-wise. The potatoes, of course, were the, the worst part there. Um, I had a salad before that, and then I did splurge. They had an open bar, so I decided to have one alcoholic drink. I had kind of a, a mix. It was supposed to be a fuzzy navel, but they did not have peach schnapps. I don't understand how you don't have peach schnapps. So instead they put a mango vodka in it and you know mango vodka and uh, orange juice and it was really good and not quite a, a fuzzy navel which is my really my favorite drink um, but it was good and I had one drink and so that was my splurging I did have a um, chocolate shake for dessert so that was you know that's a pretty big carb load right there but I decided I wanted to have something sweet and so that's what I had for my birthday and the Christmas party and then today I'm back to low carbing I had eggs and sausage for breakfast my ketone drink had some chicken for lunch and I'm not sure what we're gonna have for dinner I think we're gonna do we found some uh, more um, sale steak on sale at Walmart today so we're probably gonna have some steak and peppers or something like that for dinner but I'm right back to low carving, you know, just a little bit of a splurge yesterday and I was good all the way up until the party. I don't like to do like a full day splurge because I just feel like there's too many carbs involved. So um, I feel I feel really good. I, I can't tell you how good I've been feeling. Um, I've been doing really good on the low carb and even though, you know, I'm doing a low carb on a budget, I've been sticking to it even if I have to eat hot dogs <laughs> and I can, I can just, I can feel my insides and my stomach I can feel I'm I'm so much um, you know I'm losing weight I'm losing inches and I'm down you know to where I was way before and so I went into my closet last night and I said I'm gonna try on all my clothes and I've got my pants out I got my shirts out and I can fit in all of my clothes you know from before I gain all this extra weight I can fit in all my clothes when I was at my smallest point in that area and some of them are even looser, you know, definitely in the legs, especially I can tell my legs are smaller now than they were at the same weight before. And you know, my shirt, so I'm just, I'm really stoked, really excited. In fact, I have a lot of my shirts are really, really loose. So I kind of need to buy a few, but I don't want to spend the money until I lose some more weight. So I'm going to try to stick it out until I can lose even more weight and then get some sizes I haven't fit into in a really, really long time. So super stoked about that. Um, thank you for all the birthday wishes. I got a lot of birthday wishes. It was, um, it was fun. It was, um, it was real pretty neat to go to the state. I don't, I couldn't really see much because it was dark. So that was kind of a bummer. I would have loved to have seen what it looked like in the daylight, but they did have a lot of really pretty holiday Christmas lights up. And so it looked pretty cool. Um, let's see, I don't have a whole lot else to say. Um, it's really cold here. I know it's really cold all over across the nation. And for here in Grants Pass, um, it, we woke up and it was 28 or 27, something like that, um, around mid-morning. And frosting and ice everywhere as the trees are frosty. And up in the hills, you can see the, the fog kind of made the trees all white. So it looks really pretty. 
and about three this afternoon it was still it's still frosty it's still below freezing it's about 30 so gonna be another cold night tonight hope everyone's staying warm and I will see you on my next update go ahead and like my YouTube channel my Facebook page and have a great Saturday